name is Singe Tsering. I'm from uh, Gilgit, Baltistan. Uh, you talked about U.S. failures in Afghanistan and repeatedly said that uh, Pakistan has done much better than the U.S. Maybe one of the reasons is that Pakistan has been helping the Taliban, which is killing U.S. soldiers. Uh, so next time, since you're on the Defense Committee, maybe you want to sit in front of those mothers and wives who have lost their sons and husbands and explain to them why you take money from the U.S. and then give it to Taliban to kill the U.S. soldiers. Now, coming to uh, Kashmir, since I'm from Gilgit, Baltistan, I see both of you as a proxy of Pakistani military, not representing Kashmir. Pakistan has proxies in Indian Kashmir. They have weapons and explosives. You come here as a proxy with sweet talk. Every time when the money dries up, you show up here with blackmail, Russia talk, China talk, Iran. I request U.S. to get out of this vicious cycle. Pakistan is no, not good for any country, and it has not done any good for the United States, and it, it is not good for the people of Kashmir. You occupy one-third of Kashmir, an occupier cannot be a friend of Kashmir on the other side. You have been exploiting resources in Gilgit, Baltistan, last point, without paying royalty or compensation a single penny for the last 70 years. I call you a thief in Gilgit, Baltistan, and a thief in Gilgit, Baltistan cannot be a friend in Jammu and Kashmir, a thief in Azad Kashmir without paying royalty for Mangla Dam that you mentioned and having free electricity. You cannot be a friend in Kashmir. The only thing that is good is that Pakistani army wants to maintain a status quo because that is a money-making machine and that is what Kashmir is. You and Resolution want you to withdraw. That is the first prerequisite. I want everyone here to go on internet. It's a one-page document, only one-page document. The first prerequisite is you get out of Gilgit, Baltistan and Azad Kashmir and then the people of Kashmir, the United Nations and Indian government will sit down to form a mechanism to hold the plebiscite and this double talk that you have been doing in Afghanistan and in Kashmir and in the U.S., it needs to be exposed. And I will tell you, everywhere you go, there will be someone from Gilgit-Baltistan exposing Pakistan.